Lord, Pitbull. We did fight and forget Pitbull, and then so you don't talk about brother. Yeah. Um, Bruce Tense and David Hart smote him. After that, he had numbered the people, and right. David said unto the Lord, Hey, like we have to the man that kill him kids, man. I wonder what the hell him just do. The world is the same thing with David. David, I wonder what the hell him just do. You know what I mean? Because there's a spirit doing it, man. A spirit leading him, leading him to do it. You know what I mean? The king of the kings. Um, prison. Okay. Come on. First Kings 22 verse 19 And he said Hear thou Therefore The word of the Lord I saw the Lord sitting On his, on his throne And all the hosts of heaven Standing by him On his right and Anne is left. And the Lord said, Who shall persuade Ahab that he may go up and fall at Ramat Gilead? Alright, so the Lord of a spirit stem will be a scully. When I'm sitting down on the earth for, the, for, for, for um, complete certain tasks, man, get certain things done. You know what I mean? In this case, the Lord put out an infant Ahab. Ahab. King Ahab <laughs> get a, um, a cross here painted on him. Lord, I'm about to take him out, man. So the Lord wants him to come into certain action that he should die. And the action of the Lord set him for this good war at Ramon Gilead, man. This is the Lord of a send all a spirit. I'm not sure if you have air, you know. Most of the spirit to, to, to as a prophet, man. <laughs> to be a false prophet. You know what I mean? I make him listen to that false prophet. Say, I'm going to win. And I'm going to put the spirit directly upon him, too, you know. And, you know what I mean? But if just make it more dramatic, <laughs> you put it upon the, um, the prophets, man. Hey, can the Lord, his Lord is like that, man. Good storyteller, you know. Yeah, a little more flair, a little more drama to the thing. You know what I mean? Put some salty pot. Yeah, put some salty pot. So just put it for the prophets and the prophets of nature. You know what I mean? And then another spirit for Ahab, 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 be, Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> My brother. And one said, and this manner, and another said, and that manner. Right. Oh. And there came forth a spirit and stood before the Lord right. and said, I will persuade Ahab, I will persuade him. And the Lord said unto him, Wherewith? And he said, oh, What man are you going to do it, man? How are you going to do it? Huh? And he said, I will go forth and I will be a lying spirit in the mouth of all his prophets. Right, you say I'm going to be a lying spirit. In the mouth of all air of prophets, man. So that's how the Lord get air to go to war and die. See, so when I see a man get put to death on the earth, there's a cause in heaven already set. <laughs> you know what I mean? There's a cause in heaven, a flood of death movement. I spray small cup down and make sure I'm in a bowl. And he said, Thou shalt persuade him and prevail. Also, go forth and do so. Right, no. So, so yeah, I'm going to be successful because um, the Lord sanctioned it. What the Lord said goes, you know? Huh? He said, no, therefore, behold, the Lord had put a lying spirit in the mouth of all these thy prophets, and the Lord had spoken evil concerning thee. 
Alright. So you that? The Lord spoke it evil concerning the mother, concerning the two little daughter, and concerning the man who do the job. The Lord speak evil against everybody that's You know what I mean? That is the only explanation. There's no other explanation, Pete. Ecclesiastes 39, verse 28. Right. So there be spirits that are creative of vengeance. Right, so it's the Lord's vengeance, man. It is the Lord's vengeance. And many other things that take place on the planet. You know what I mean? That, that seems to be unfortunate. For the regular man, it's the Lord's vengeance, yeah? Being judged. So there be spirits that are creative for vengeance. Which in their fury lay on sore strokes. In the time of destruction, they pour out their forces and appease the wrath of him that made them. Right, so the wrath that was carried out was, was the wrath of the Most High. You know what I mean? Lord's indignation. Lord's indignation. So, a man has said, Oh, can a man do this? No, I said, A man did. The Most High did that. You know what I mean? And have fun doing it too. Wouldn't the heavens are laugh, man? But see, what you people, you people think that flesh is the end of the all, man. You know what I mean? You might love flesh, flesh and blood, but the Lord don't love flesh and blood, man. That's why I'm doing any farmer way or feel like today because in truth and reality, flesh and blood only bring sorrow to his children, man. See? That's how flesh and blood brings sorrow to the Lord's children. So the Lord no love flesh and blood, man. Flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of heaven, man. So the Lord will get rid of all flesh and blood, man. So when a man I feel upset because of flesh and blood get destroyed. See? The carnal. You know what I mean? The Lord don't give a damn. That's why the Lord makes so much duffy at the end of the You know, a better place when you come out of flesh. Hmm? The Lord knows that. Take care of the Lord. Wicked to take out of flesh. You're wicked to want to stay in the flesh. You're wicked to want to stay in the flesh. Wickedness. Yeah. Even though the Lord, I cannot be held. Oh. Evil, man. And flesh is evil. You know what I mean? The scripture tells the flesh lusted to envy. You know what I mean? It says, oh, we all sin and come short of the glory of God. And once in the flesh, you are a sinner. Once you're walking as a mortal being now in the flesh, is a sinner, man. And, um, yeah, they, they deserve nothing but to be judged. But luckily the Lord have mercy upon some that humble themselves because a man walk in a flesh here thinking that look, I'm innocent, no guilty and nothing. Seeing God obligated to him with an entitlement type of mentality like God have just give up anything you want. Yeah, oh really man? Mind. Hey, the cause of that BSS is the Christian speech Bible from. Like, like God, God obligated to you. The scripture says, what is man? That the Lord should be mindful of him, man. Man is nothing, yes? Yeah? Yeah, so man does. He has some of us to say, man are those. All right. Ecclesiasticus 
10 verse 9. <clears throat> verse 9. Say, um, why is earth and ashes proud? So why is earth and ashes proud, man? Because a nigger, a flesh of blood, and everything say, oh, look, man. Shit don't stink. You know what I mean? There is, no, there is not a more wicked thing with a covetous man <clears throat> for such an one set at his own soul to sell. Right, and, and guess what, man? The so called white man is the, is the boss of the type of pride. And all you can see are the shit and the fins of the so called white man going with. He portrays himself as him innocent and everybody all forget him and he might try the one and try and set morals for the earth and he might try to bring democracy. You know what I mean? They might treat women bad over us, they might treat children bad over us, they might treat homosexual bad. And he might the only human monetary. You know what I mean? You know what I mean while him destroy shit, destroy people. But yet, innocent. You know? I don't think he believes him. You think he actually believes him innocent enough? Where it takes smooth. Tricky oneself. See it? Well, it's gonna say you're a wild earth that matches the road, man. A man can't do confess him fault in a society, man. You feel like saying, tell him him fault. You feel like I offend him, I try to offend him. Oh, you're a style, man. You're this way. Look man, the day is coming. The Lord is going to have no mercy for the ones who can't confess their wrongs, man. If you can't confess the wrong, you're going to be judged some harsh way, man. Very harsh. You know what I mean? You may know what you're talking about, you may walk with fear. You're going to know what fear is, man. The Lord will teach you fear. <laughs> now, luckily, Nobody have control over them own flesh, man. And the Lord will put the spirit of fear on you, regardless of what your mind tells us. You know? You don't come out there that what feel like you can't control that map can't do that shit. You know what I mean? Feed the key and him feel like a pain lick him in the jar corner. See? You couldn't stop it. So if you can't stop a pain, fam, 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 come up on your flesh. How oh, you gonna stop fear, man? Nigga stupid as hell. See? You can't stop yourself from getting a common code, but you can't stop fear. <laughs> really? You have to fear something, you know? If you don't fear this, you have to fear that. I'm sure it's Tell us if you fear the Lord, you begin to know knowledge of it. So, you don't have to fear. This is Job 4, verse 7. So remember, I pray thee, whoever perish being innocent, and so all who are mentioned the innocent talk and the innocent talk, look how you make the innocent fit in them and make a girl piece of herself and I get emotional over the thing. Scripture look, man, nobody perish being innocent. This might sound harsh to the regular man ears, but the Lord has got the worst than this, man. The Lord of the worst than this man. This is going to be the least. You know what I mean? The Lord of cut out, cut out from the land. Woman. Baby. Little girl. Little boy. Just like that man. Don't know the power that they're dealing with. Yeah? Just like that. See the prophet seven die away and by away you do you uh, we are proud with the head. Hi. So what up to, what happened to the mad man or the something? Go on your way. Know what I mean? That in itself and Lord. I'm gonna make sure the Lord make you have a heavy price to pay me. Don't know where you pay me. The only mob and the only boss. <laughs> we know if you try style. Can you have all the boss on the earth? We are not trying to style away it. We are styling boss of all boss. And you are get wet. You are mad. 